What's up, what's up? This is Devin. Uh, thanks for tuning into the channel. Um, right now I got uh, this topic. It's commitment and life as a feeling process. And uh, I'll just start with this. Like, I mean, everybody going through life, it's like you're never going to know all the answers. Especially you're never going to know all the answers, uh, answers um, intellectually. Intuitively, like, you, I think you, it's like you get those feelings. It's like, what should I do? What should I do? But then it's like, I believe that life is a feeling process and you have to feel things out and feel what works for you. And sometimes it is about putting your hand on the, the hot stove and pulling it back and realizing, okay, that didn't feel right. And life is just all about, I remember, um, what's it called? It's the, the science Liberty Science Center uh, I remember when I was little like they had this I mean they still have it because I went out as a camp counselor a couple years ago um, they had this did this dark tunnel and you go in it and you can't see shit and the way you had to figure yourself out especially when you're little and you don't have because then I kind of realized you it was actually really easy when I got older but like basically you had to feel around on the walls and sometimes they'd have little dead ends and stuff and you turn and you hit it and then you got to realize and it's pitch black you got to feel the walls and keep following it and then eventually um you'll make your way out but like you can't see so the only way to really make your way out is that you have to touch on the walls and feel if it's a dead end and if you got to go this way and that's kind of how I view life it's like life is just a, a maze and you're trying to get to the finish line whatever your finish line and your goal is and they have all these loops and turns but the only way you're going to find your way out is if you're going to feel it you can try to think which is more like the seeing but like you can't see the future you're not a fucking oracle or prophet maybe you are I don't know maybe you're a psychic I'm not a fucking doctor. I don't know if that shit's possible. But um, basically, you got to feel your way out. And I, I believe that you should use your inner compass. To me, that's like your values, your morals. Some people don't sit down and think about them. I mean, I sit down and think about my own and what I'm about and who I want to be. And I try to follow that. And that's how my how I judge my feelings. Like, do is what I feel in accordance with my values my inner compass and that is how I direct myself on where to go that is how that's the hand that I use to feel the walls of my experiences and um I mean and also it's not gonna always be great there's gonna be times where like it feels like you're not feeling shit you just feel numb as hell and you don't know why and you're just trying to get out of it and you don't know but it's like just that commitment to to life and just the commitment that to figuring it out like no matter what the problem is the obstacle is how hard it gets it's like i'm committed to figuring this out and seeing this shit through no matter what i'll die on a treadmill as will smith says like this is what i believe and i believe this is possible and i'm gonna feel my way out to figure this out even if it takes my whole life i'm just gonna keep working to and a lot of it's just kind of just the self realization of yourself but it's the commitment to that that i'm gonna do whatever it takes to become self-realized to really see what i'm capable of and what i want out of my life and it's really about the journey you know it's like everything's gonna be loops and turns and times when it's slow times when it's fast times when it's great times when it's bad but it's like that's all life and you got to take the good with the bad and just experience it all feel it all feel it all deeply within yourself don't try to run away from and turn around and go back to the start of the tunnel staying in that little metaphor it's like you got to keep going because you want to get you want to see the light um and it's like you just got to keep feeling it out and just enjoy the journey enjoy feeling life and experiencing life and the commitment you made to figuring it out and just to kind of end it i mean uh les brown i mean i heard him say this one time on one of his speeches it's just and i always like that it's like it's not over until i win you know 
sometimes you're gonna get hurt. Sometimes it, everything don't feel good. Some things are gonna feel better than others, but no matter where you are, it's not over until you feel the success. You feel that you've accomplished what you've been put here to accomplish. You feel that you've reached your maximum capacity. And that's really just where I'm going with this video. It's just life is a feeling process and you need to be committed to that feeling process and feeling it all the way through. And uh, that's pretty much it. If you like the content, please click the subscribe button. Leave your comments below. Click the like button if you, if you like the different stuff. And it's Devin Coates. Till next time, peace out.